The WS Society is a very special institution and the Signet Library is a very special place full of amazing treasures and important collections. We have the enormous privilege and responsibility of looking after the Signet Library. This is a 200-year-old building, one of the defining buildings of Enlightenment Edinburgh. Our collections go back centuries. We have items that are in a collection which are 500 years old. It's important that we fulfill our responsibility to conserve and make that heritage accessible. And we need third-party support for that. Charitable status is an important first step in that process. The introduction begins the words, Behold Scotland, behold the Kingdom of Scotland. And of course, this is before the Union. And um, I think that they, they were struck just how beautiful and how varied yeah. it was as a place. We've got all the way the novels. In fact, we've got, we've got a copy of The Bride of Lemonwar here, um, which is a much later edition. This is fun copy from the 19th century. Mm. So I just, I just brought that out in case people weren't familiar with the story so they could have a, have a look at it. We've started various initiatives to reach groups that might not otherwise come to the Signet Library to learn about the history of the society and the importance of the rule of law today and harder to reach audiences, including school children and those from disadvantaged groups. And there's so much more that we can do there to engage with those audiences. And that's a central thread of the new Enlightenment strategy. We feel that the move to charitable status would be the optimum strategy at the moment to preserve the WS Society and make the Society and its collections available for future generations. Digitize them and then run it through um, OCR software, start to create um, catalogue records which can be searchable. So you can search for individual people or places or dates. One of our fellows, Dame Helena Kennedy, once said, law is the bedrock of a nation. And I think that's very true. Legal materials are of interest and of national importance, not just as legal materials. These are also social, political, economic and, and sociological documents. It's important that their content is understood as such. This is potentially uh, an epoch-making moment in the long history of the society. It is as momentous uh, a moment historically as the decision to build the Signet Library in the first place. One of the activities that people might not know so much about is our work in connection with charities. The Society has a long association with the charitable sector and we have always done work in that area. It dates back over 250 years. Over the last decade we've been more active in the charitable status because we provide a charity administration service and we act for a number of Scottish charities and that's an area where we'd like to do more, where there's a really good fit between the Society as an organisation for public benefit and for other charities and organisations organizations working in the third sector.